of bullying in the classroom has gone viral and the parents of the girl at the center of it have had enough. They talked about it with our Marcella Robertson. In just days, this video, it's got more than a million views. It's short, but you can hear her laughing as she throws a pencil into another girl's hair. Well, Bradley and Darlene Taylor don't find anything funny about this video. I saw it, my heart started to race because I was, um, I was devastated that they had sh uh, did that to her. The girl with the pencil in her hair, it's their daughter. You know, seeing our daughter, you know, in this video being basically made fun of, it's, it's a form of public humiliation. Um, we, were, we were absolutely furious about it. My daughter, you know, she, like, like other African Americans, we all have a hard time with our hair as it is. The Taylors reached out to the school, Brentsville High, and were told the situation was mediated by moving the student seats in the classroom. They believe much more should have been done. It was just hard to see them using it as a dartboard. Our hair is beautiful and we should be able to wear it the way we want to wear it without trying to style it so that it makes other people feel comfortable around us or with the way they view us or whatever whatever it is that goes through their minds to let them know that um, it's not funny. Our hair isn't funny. It's beautiful. The Taylors say they don't feel like the response here from the school was good enough. So now they've taken their concerns to the school board. In Prince William County, Marcella Robertson, WUSA 9. Now Darlene Taylor says she posted the video to her Facebook page after she felt the school didn't do enough. School officials told us this behavior is not condoned in any way, but they are not able to share if those students involved were disciplined or not. There is a community forum tomorrow to discuss this incident and diversity in schools.